Hello. So I am at the Fillmore, Fillmore West, as some people would call. The other one was in New York back in the day. But um, so this is the upstairs bar area where all of the incredible posters are at. It's really great to look up here. Um, yeah, pretty cool, pretty cool. Uh, I went to see the replacements here when I was 15 and right around here there used to be band, small bands that would play somewhere around here. I can't remember where but there was, uh, I saw a band called The Furies play here. Uh, three women, I believe one of them went on to play with Unwound. Uh, I'm not completely sure of that but um, I'll do a little more touring around here. So right here is another bar. It's up in the balcony. Um, and uh, that's where some of the seating is to see the stage. You can see people getting ready, getting some sound checks going. Um, and so here's one. And uh, here's another. So sitting here, and I saw uh, Paul Westerberg play here uh, back in the 90s. And I also saw Weezer when they were touring Pinkerton. It just came out. So as you can see here, everybody getting ready. Yada, yada, yada. And then more posters up here. You can see, like so. Heading downstairs right now from the backstage area. Many legends have been here. Right here. You can see. No Bram. Not sure who else that is, but. So now I'm coming over here where the stage is. You can see from the middle. And then I stood right here when I saw the replacements when I was. 15 years old on the Please to Meet Me tour. And so I was crushed up against here, looking around, and then Paul would have been there, Tommy there, Chris Mars up there, and then right there was the first time I ever saw Slim Dunlop. So yeah, pretty cool. I was crushed, like, Ugh! And then um, I also saw 10,000 Maniacs play here also. So, pretty cool. So now I'm uh, kind of stage left towards the middle. And I stood right about here, like so. Maybe a little bit closer, right here. And uh, you could see sort of the chandeliers. And I saw uh, the church play. Um, Australian band, Under the Milky Way Tonight, was a big single out at that time. Two of the best guitar players I've ever seen in my life. And to my left, there was this, I was about 15 or 16 years old. Hey guys, how's it going? Good, how you doing? Good, I'm just doing a little video. So, nice. so. I'm wearing, my, I'm wearing the Fillmore jacket. Awesome, awesome, yeah. awesome. So right here, I stood and uh, um, these big tall dudes were standing next to me and they were both smoking a joint. And then kind of kept staring up at them like that. And then the guy goes, takes his joint, and gives it down to me. 21 plus year old guy giving a 15 year old a joint, and I smoked it. 
and uh, I got really high and I watched like this. Amazing. And uh, my, guitar t my guitar teacher, George Cole, was in, a, was in a band called Beatnik Beach. And uh, so that's how we got in. His name is George, George Cole, amazing guitar player. You can still see him. He plays a lot of jazz. And um, yeah, so that's my tour. Making a quick correction. Um, it was Janet Weiss from Sleater Kinney that was in the Furies. Uh, she was not an unwound. Uh, so my bad on that one. So uh, I've seen Sleater Kinney a couple times. Saw them at the El Rey. They were fantastic. So there you go.